and welcome back to the channel on this video I want to do a comparison of the Super 73 RX versus the Lyric Graffiti and I'm gonna run down some of the spec, uh, specs and we'll do a comparison. So, let's start with the Super 73 RX. So, the Super 73 RX says, now this is, I'm going according to their website and what the specs say on their website. So they list their motor as a 750 watt motor nominal peaking at as I dodged some debris on the road peaking at 1200 watts then if you get it to off-road mode so I think they have three they have the class one class two class three and then off-road if you put it to off-road uh, mode, it says a that the motor then has a um, nominal wattage of 1200 watts, peaking at 2300 watts. So that's what the motor it claims for the motor. And then it's got the battery Uh, as a 48 volt uh, 20 amp hour. I think they've upped their battery because I don't think their battery used to be that big. But now, uh, 20 amp hour. So that's that's okay. So it's 48 volt 20 amp hour battery. Well, that 20 is better than like a 16 or 15, right? But anyway, so that's what you get for battery. It's got uh, hydraulic uh, disc brakes. It's got uh, full suspension, okay? It's got the front and rear suspension on the RX, Super 73 RX. Then the tires are 20 by four and a half uh, in the front and 20 by five in the back. And so I'm doing all this off memory. So those are the basics. I'm not sure about the controller. Uh, I don't see anything listed when I was looking at the controller. Um, so, and the bike sells for $4,000. Well, I also checked out the shipping because it doesn't tell you the shipping. You have to go through the whole cart process, put your bike in the cart, uh, go all the way through to checkout, which I did for the purposes of this video. I wanted to see, well, how much is the shipping? And so I did that. And it said flat rate, and I'm here in Oregon, and Super 73 is out of California. So it uh, quoted me a price, of, it said flat rate $150. Okay, so the bike's selling for $4,000. I'm rounding it off to the dollar, it's $39.99. Uh, or whatever, right? So I'm just going to round it off to $4,000. And you throw on another $150, you got $4,150. Okay. So let's keep that in mind, $4,150. There may be other parts of the bike that you could uh, throw in there, but those are usually the main, the battery, the motor, controller, uh, 
It's a 20 by four and a half and 20 by five wheels. Uh, hydraulic brakes. Okay, so 4150. Now let's move over to the Lyric Graffiti. So the Lyric Graffiti, which is the bike I'm on right at the moment, is a 2500 watt. I should mention it's a geared hub motor on the uh, on the RX. So then you've got on the Super 73 RX, yeah. So then you've got on the Lyric Graffiti, as I mentioned, a 2500 watt motor peaking at 4700 watts. That, of course, would also be in off-road mode. You've got a battery. Let's go, first of all, with the one battery, because it does come with an option for two, which the RX does not, as far as I'm aware, anyway. I don't, I don't believe you can get a two-battery setup um, just purchasing it direct from them without doing it yourself after. So, with the one battery, okay, it's a 17 and a half amp hour battery, so a little bit smaller. Not a lot smaller, but 17 and a half is smaller than 20. But it also is 52 volt. So it's, it's got more voltage uh, than the uh, Super 73 RX. Okay. Uh, same deal with the braking, it's a uh, hydraulic uh, brake. Pretty similar, you know, the, uh, pretty similar in a lot of ways. The tires are 20 by four, not 20 by four and a half, or 20 by five, so they're a little bit narrower. Not much, but a little bit. You notice the difference. You can tell the difference. Um, they both have headlight, tail light, brake lights, and I don't know how good the headlight is on the Super 73, but on the um, Lyric Graffiti, as you can see right now, which I'm riding in the dark, um, it's got the best headlight. I can't say enough uh, about this headlight. This is the way all e-bikes should be. They should have a light like this. Uh, anyway, so the headlight, I think this headlight is going to beat the Super 73, even though I don't know anything about the Super 73, I doubt they have this headlight on there. But anyway, even if they did, we can uh, we can just even if they even if they do, um, at least it's even. I don't think Super 73 is going to beat the uh, Grizzly or the Graffiti, I should say, with headlight. So then we get to and the controller is a 50 amp controller on this bike peaks at uh, 90 amp uh, and I don't know what the controller like I say is on the Super 73 but I'll bet you it's not a 50 amp controller peaking at 90 amp top speed of the RX I could not get a direct exact top speed but it looks like from what I could find in my digging 32 miles an hour is the highest I've heard anybody get on the Super 73. And I don't know if that was on a downhill or on the flat or what, but I know this bike can go a little bit faster than that. Uh, I've had it up to 37 miles an hour, but on the flat, I've had it more, I've had it hit 35. Um, so pretty close. Let's let's give the edge to the graffiti because I think it would beat the RX in a race. The other thing that this bike has, the graffiti has that the Super 73 does not, is a gearless hub motor, which I kind of like better. Uh, um, I, now that I'm riding one, because I had never ridden or had a gearless hub motor before, now that I've had this one, I really like this. And 
one of my favorite things to talk about is regen braking. I absolutely love the regen braking. So you're not going to get that on the Super 73 being a geared hub motor. And I'm not sure what the value would be, like money-wise, what the what the value would be on getting regen braking. Um, but so the give and take would be basically the Super 73 has a smaller motor, a slightly bigger battery, less voltage. And I might be missing something now. But anyway, let's go to the price of the graffiti. This is with one battery. So the price right now is $3,100. So $3,100, free shipping. So right there, you're saving $1,050. Without ever riding a Super 73, which I've never ridden, I've sat on a Super 73 RX at the store. I, uh, this is when I was in buying mode. I was at three bikes looking at. I was looking at the Lyric Graffiti, uh, the Super 73 RX Mojave, and I was looking at the Onyx City 2. All three bikes. And I kind of, and I went to the, the only one I saw in person of the three bikes was the Super 73. I went right to the a motorcycle shop uh, not far from where I am here and uh, was checking out. I did not take it for a ride because I didn't get to the point where I was serious enough. I was going to go back I, and uh, do a test ride, but I, that day was when I did go there, I was, it was close to closing time and all, and so I didn't test it. But I sat on it, it was nice, I got to admit, it, was, it felt nice to sit on. But, uh, like I said, I didn't take it for a ride. And, but the price of the graffiti, 3100 to 4150 okay, that's 1050 And if, if the battery is a problem, not having as much amp uh, hour, if you throw in the second battery on the graffiti, toss that into your uh, uh, checkout and then pay for that, that's $3,600 free shipping. So that's still going to save you $550. $550 less and that's with two batteries. That's 35 amp hour of battery and it's 52 volt, not 48. Um, I think the, the one advantage I guess Super 73 does have is reputation because they've been out there longer than, super, than uh, Lyric Cycles. But uh, watch out for Lyric Cycles. If this bike is any indication of what they're going to have in the future, uh oh, look out. I mean, it's going to be awesome. I can't wait to see. Hopefully they don't get rid of this Scrambler style graffiti uh, style bike and they make another one and they kind of like do a little tinkering with it you know and add something to it I don't know what but um, and uh, I'd love to see what their next model is going to uh, look like um, and then they've got the voodoo and the ghost and uh, I have never obviously ridden those bikes but if they're anything like the graffiti Wow, you know, awesome bikes. So let's see what Lyric uh, Cycles does in the future because it's, uh, this is gonna be exciting. And um, I wish more people could get to try this bike. Maybe go like head to head with the Super 73 uh, RX because I think this bike would impress a lot of people.
But a lot of times all we can go by is specs and hopefully, you know, people put videos up on YouTube type deal and they give you an opinion that you trust. And uh, that's about all you can go by, so it's kind of tough. And even if you trust somebody and you think, well, I believe in what they say, it's, it's still not the same no matter what you do uh, as you getting on the bike and riding it. Because we all have different views and opinions on things and what we're looking for. And like I say, this is an awesome bike, an absolute joy to ride. Every time I ride it, I love this bike. It's my favorite bike. And it's gonna be hard to top this bike for me. Yeah, like, I don't know what I'm gonna find that I like better than this, but anyway, um, but then you may get on the bike and say, crap, you know, I don't like this bike, it's crap. Um, I don't think you'll say that, but you might. And that's, that's fine. I mean, we're, we're all different. So we're all looking for different things on the bike. Maybe you're looking for something, like maybe you need the rear suspension. I can tell you for a fact, this bike doesn't really need, in my opinion, it, it'd be almost wasting your money, I think. Yeah, getting a rear suspension, if you had to pay like six, seven hundred dollars, whatever it is, extra. I think you'd be almost, you'd be better to use that money towards something else, like the second battery or uh, accessories for your bike. Oh, it's weird that guy was driving without his headlights on. Anyway, so anyway, I, I would take, without even trying that uh, Super 73, I would put that money in my pocket, that extra savings, and take this bike. But that's that's just my opinion. And like I say, we're all entitled to our opinions and, and uh, But this bike is an absolute joy to ride, and I can't say enough about it. So if you've got any comments in the comments below, um, you can uh, make them in the comments below, I should say. And uh, what do you think about the, uh, the two bikes? I mean, you've probably not ridden, well, I don't know anybody that's had both bikes or that owns both bikes. There may be people out there that have ridden both though. And uh, maybe they can uh, form an opinion or they have formed an opinion already. Which one would you pick? Uh, would you pick the Super 73 RX or would you pick the Lyric Graffiti? I do want to mention too that if you did want to buy a Lyric Graffiti and it's totally up to you which which bike you want maybe you're not buying either one maybe you're buying something totally different but uh, I do have a link in the description and if you uh, use that link and then use the discount code Oregon eBiker Mark that's all one word that will get you an additional $100 off the bike. So, if you go back to that, if you want the one battery set up, the 31 would go down $100, for example, and that would even save you more. That would save you, uh, that would take it down to 3,000, that would save you $1,150 compared to the Super 73 RX. So, if you like this video, Hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, we appreciate that. Hit that subscribe button. If you'd like to be notified as to when the next video comes up here on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And once again, thank you for joining me again for another video here on Oregon E-Biker Mark. And until next time.
Take care.